Hey guys, this is Gabby from the Savvy Professor. In today's video, I will discuss the differences between USDT and USD. Watch till the end to know the differences. But first, let's start with the differences. So the main difference between them is their nature and form. USD is a physical, tangible currency that exists in paper bills and coins. In other words, you can hold USD in your hands as coins and paper bills, and you can carry them in your pocket and store them in your safe. USD is also a digital currency that exists as entries in a bank. On the other hand, USDT only exists in digital form because it is a digital token. It means that you cannot see or hold it because it is a computer code that holds information. USD therefore exists in a diverse nature and form. Uses USD is the recognized and accepted medium of exchange for goods and services, especially in the US. It is also accepted globally for international trade. In contrast, USDT is mainly used among cryptocurrency traders. Some people also use it to hedge against the volatility of other cryptocurrencies as well as transfer money internationally because it is cheaper and faster. USD therefore has major usage. Underlying value USD has an intrinsic value because it is backed up by the US economy and its military power. It is similar to a valuable metal like gold, which has value due to its usefulness in making jewelry and its rarity. Conversely, USDT has a pegged value. The value of the USDT is tied to the USD in that if the USD loses value, USDT also loses value and vice versa. USD is dependent in terms of value. USD therefore is independent in value. Regulation USD is heavily regulated by the government through institutions such as the Federal Reserve and Treasury. Such institutions create rules on how the USD is created, distributed, and used. On the other side, USDT regulations are not created and enforced by strong institutions, hence not considered strict. USD therefore is safer. But do they have any similarities? Yes. The two are similar in that they have the same value. This means that one USD is equal to one USDT, except for insignificant variations that occur sometimes. So to sum up, how do they compare? USDT versus USD. Although the two represent value, the USD commands a higher authority due to its wide use, acceptance, and strong regulation. I, however, find USDT easier to use when trading cryptocurrencies and when transferring money internationally. Their differences in usage makes them equally good. Thanks for watching!